In a graphics card, there are four major components to think about. The processor, or the GPU, the memory, the connection to the motherboard, and the ports on the card. Let's start with the processor, otherwise known as the GPU. It controls the placement of each pixel on the monitor. It is not unlike the CPU in the fact that it performs complex calculations. Unlike the CPU, the graphics processor performs mathematical and geometrical calculations specifically for graphic rendering. A GPU can produce a lot of heat, which is why they're often found under a heatsink and sometimes a fan. The largest producers of GPUs are NVIDIA and AMD. Next, let's take a look at the memory. Like system memory found on motherboards, it holds information for quick access. It is different in the fact that it is optimized for use with graphics. Memory on graphics cards holds information on each pixel like its color and placement. Graphics card memory is also able to store completed images temporarily due to the fact that part of the memory can act as a frame buffer. The third part of a graphics card is the connection. Graphics cards today often use a PCI Express connection, but older graphics cards may use an AGP or regular PCI connection. The connection to a motherboard doesn't always provide enough power for a graphics card, so some may have a 6-pin connector on the top or side for direct connection to the power supply. The last component on a graphics card is the ports and cables to connect the monitor and computer. The most commonly used would be the Video Graphics Array, or VGA port, but it is quickly being replaced by Digital Visual Interface, DVI, and the High Definition Multimedia Interface, HDMI. Other common or well-known video ports include S-Video, Display, and Composite. Here's a few terms to remember when looking at graphics cards. Dual head compatibility is the ability for a graphics card to support two monitors at once. The GPU clock speed is the speed that the GPU can execute instructions, measured in megahertz. Lastly, frame rate is the measurement of images displayed per second. Most games run at about 60 frames per second, and movies run at about 48, or even 72 frames per second. Now that you know what each part does, and terms to think about, let's learn how to install a graphics card.
see ya.